Yo guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how you guys are gonna be able to make it where as you drive your car around, uh, you can earn money. So I remember a while ago, I think it was like three years ago before I started learning to do scripting in Roblox, I actually wanted to do this and I could, I literally searched everywhere off of YouTube to try to find a way to, uh, to do this, but I never could actually, like, you know, when you drive your car, you earn money. I was trying to make a games back then, and I just could not figure out how to do this. This was like the main thing, and this is what stopped me from actually making games back then, is because I thought like there's no way. But I mean, here let me show you guys what I mean. So as you see, I'm driving, I'm earning money up here. Um, I don't really like make games anymore, so I, I might as well just give away all of the stuff to you guys, like you know. Just give away all the information and stuff I've learned. I've stopped scripting for a while now. I mean, it's fun and all. It's just that I'm not enjoying doing it anymore. So I might as well just give away my knowledge to you guys to show you guys how to do stuff. So this video here is actually kind of a part three. So I made the last two videos was one, how to import some cards into Roblox Studio. And the second one was how to actually give it life and make it work. So this will be the third one. Um, eventually, what we're gonna end up doing with this whole series is making a whole roleplay game at the end. The money part is one of them, pretty much. That's just the third video in the series. Next, we're probably gonna do like, I don't know, like a map or something, or a dealership. It depends, whichever one you want. Just leave a comment down below as well as subscribe and like the video. Without further ado, let's hop right in and show you guys how to do it. So also, I do wanna mention that the scripts for this video, you do not have to type them in. I will literally paste them um, in a link in the description. Just click that link and it will take you straight to where you have to go. Just copy and paste them in. Um, but I will explain some parts of the code just in case you want to change around some stuff. Uh, but yeah, so let's hop right into it and show you guys what you guys are going to be able to get from this. Okay, so I'm on a uh, test place here, or like a little test area where I used to you know, work in cars and whatnot. But we just, you know, the, the huge roleplay game we were working on just got cancelled because of time issues. So we just have a bunch of random car models now. But here's one of our car models. This one's a really nice one, actually. But unfortunately, we never got around to using it. That's why there's a police one. But let's hop right in and uh, show you guys what we're going to get. So uh, let me hit play. Alright, so we're going to be driving around. Alright, I'll uh, cut the video until we start making money, um, because I actually definitely left the studs pretty high for this, so it's going to be uh, pretty boring to watch me just drive around, and for some reason the automatic mode is not working, so, or it is working, it's just glitched, it doesn't shift up, okay, oh there you guys go, we just got 544 uh, for whatever studs we just drove. So that's pretty much how it's gonna work and you keep driving and it keeps racking up money and miles. Um, uh, okay, whatever. Okay, so pretty much that's how it's gonna work. So let me go ahead and show you guys how to do it. Now we are gonna be working on the other car from the last two videos. So this car we were working on the last video, so this car is not tuned yet. So I might make a video on that one to show you guys how to tune this car down. Um, I don't think any of these other cars here actually has the stuff in it. The first thing we're gonna need is probably the, let me make the leaderboard first, since that's like the easiest thing to do. Uh, so the place you're gonna wanna go is into server, script, service, right click into here. Let me check if I have one, I already have one in here. Um, uh, yeah, I have one in here. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is head over to server, script, service, click new or insert object. And you're gonna type in your script and I'm just gonna rename this to leader steps. Doesn't matter. And I'm gonna actually just speed through this here and then afterwards I'm gonna explain what it is uh, so you guys don't get bored watching me, alright?
wearing a ma I think this is it. Now you yeah, guys, you're gonna be able to see that some of the stuff here is gonna be like in red. That's because we haven't actually set it up yet in the car. This is just uh, this is just a leaderboard, so it doesn't know what the reference cache or reference miles do. So in order to do this, we actually have to go into the car chassis itself. So make sure you guys look for that, and then go into that driver's seat. And inside of driver seat, you're going to insert a new script, uh, insert object, another script, let me see. Script, make sure that local script or module script is, yes. And then once you've inserted the script, you click in, uh, inside a script, you're going to hit insert object again. So, and this time you're going to hit an int value. Make sure you're not using any of the other values, such as a boolean or a boo value or anything else. It has to be an int value. So as you guys can see all these values, make sure it's an int value because we're looking for integers. Um, which are the numbers for the miles as well as the cash so put this in and you're gonna have to rename this uh name it right here to meters driven okay so it's not really miles it's more like meters but you can just set it up to how you want so once you've done this inside a script uh there's you're gonna have to yeah this is where the car will actually add money for the amount of meters driven so i'm actually going to cut through this real quick and afterwards i'm going to explain how you can change around some stuff all right there uh, I think I might have made a few errors maybe uh, local meters driven nuts god oh, messed up right here equals script uh, I was wondering why I was getting errors throughout so this shouldn't even be here okay there you go now this should work so as you guys see and this is and make sure you guys have named this thing the right way if you change the names of this you're gonna have to change it again here now I, this doesn't matter if you change the name here it matters if you change it right here um, if so, say I made this like miles driven, I I can leave this here as meters driven because this is inserting a new variable, and then this here could be called, but this would have to be called miles driven, and uh, yeah, and it would just affect everything else in here as well. So make sure you guys uh, don't make mistakes like this, otherwise the code will not work. Um, so what? The? Okay, so there you go. Let's just click it like that. Okay, good. So from here. Uh, you got this and uh, we're still having some errors in here that's because it's not fixed okay good is it i don't think it's fixed local mod oh yeah i did i didn't do it right here so make sure you guys don't make these small mistakes local i didn't even name it here no cash can i type please cash is equal to instant dot new blah, and i literally spelled it wrong up here all right, this happens when you try to type code fast. You mess up everywhere. Okay, so that should be good, and this should be good. Local player, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so yeah. All right, so let me explain what's happening in this code. So this code here is saying that if the series is using velocity and magnitude to determine the movement of the cars, so it's also saying here that if the value of meters driven is uh, greater than 1,000, so this is 1,000 studs, then you're going to add... Uh, 200 cash to the car and also one mile so you can see this here let me actually code uh, type in my thing I think all right let me type in here this here is or no it's actually not that so it's um, uh, studs driven and amount of cash uh, added in so you could change this around if you want 
one to give play. Um, so I could drive a thousand studs and I'll get 200 cash and then obviously you can change this for every car so you can make it where the car drives only a thousand studs and gets 500 money if it's a better car and this here is the miles miles driven all right so it's pretty simple easy stuff here and I, like I said you don't have to type this all in the link will be down in the description that's where you can easily get this now I'm pretty sure that is the only two things so let's actually head back to the game and hop in this car let me put a spawner here uh, spawner there you go spawn all right now we can hit play money hopefully everything works okay there goes the leaderboard so we can hop right in and drive a thousand studs and get some money all right and again this car isn't be tuned at all so just basic tune whatever's on it so if you don't want to see a tuning guide video uh, let me know in the comments down below so I'm just gonna drive around in a circle here uh, there you guys go 200 we just drove a uh, thousand studs let me just drive one more time there you guys go another set so like I said guys the money will save and if you guys want to see like like what, how to use the money and make it like a dealership system I can do that now customizing cars kind of hard because I could make a video on that but it's kind of hard but we will eventually get there like I said guys if you guys enjoyed this video please do drop a like and subscribe and also let me know what video you want to see next because uh, we are going to end up making a full roleplay game kind of thing so yeah I'll see you guys in the next video